67. What? Do I have something? Something on my face? You're a very attractive person. Thank you. Amanda never said how attractive you were. Well, maybe she doesn't think I'm attractive. I don't think it's a matter of opinion. Empirically, you are attractive. Amanda is my friend. So? So you're going with her. So? So you're coming on to me. No, I wasn't. What? Yeah, man, say a woman's attractive without a thing. Come on. Okay, okay. So let's say for the sake of argument, it wasn't a come on. Ugh. I take it back, okay? I take it back. You can't take it back. Why not? Because it's already out there. Oh, geez. What are we supposed to do? Call the cops because it's already out there? Just let it lie, okay? Great. Let it lie. Okay. That's what I always say. Let it lie. Want to say what's up tonight? Yeah. See what I did? I didn't let it lie. Harry. I said I wouldn't, and I didn't. Harry. I went the other way. Harry. What? Great. You do realize, of course, men and women cannot be friends. Why not? What I'm saying is, and this is not a come on in any way, shape, or form, is that men and women can't be friends. Because the sex part always gets in the way. That's not true. I have a notion and there is no sex involved. No, you don't. Yes, I do. No, you don't. Yes, I do. You only think you do. You're saying I'm having sex with them without my knowledge? No. What I'm saying is they all want to have sex with you. They do not. You do. Do not. You do. How do you know? Right. Right. Because no man can be friends with a woman that he finds attractive. He always wants to have sex with her. So you're saying that a man can be friends with a woman he finds unattractive? No, he probably just pretty much wants to nail them too. What if they don't want to have sex with you? It doesn't matter. Because the sex thing is already out there. And so the friendship is ultimately doomed, and that's the end of the story. Well, I guess we're not going to be friends then. Guess not. That's too bad. You were the only person I knew in New York.